That's right. You heard the young lady. It's Media Cartel, where you can get all the information you need. I'm yours truly, Ozzy Oz. My main man, Mr. Ripper. Media Cartel Mix Show at gmail.com. IG, hit us up. Facebook, hit us up. Like us. Tweet. Twitter. Spread the word. Of course, on YouTube, subscribe Media Cartel. Get all the latest interviews and podcasts that you get on that. Plus... You can download it, put it in your own storage device, whatever you might have, if you get it off of Fanburst, F-A-N-B-U-R-S-T, Fanburst.com. Hit it, download it, put it on your phone, listen to it at your job so your, your nosy neighbors won't be all in your eardrums and your pod cuticle next to you, and you can laugh and joke and they go, go, what are you listening to? You tell them motherfuckers, media, car- oh, okay, media cartel. I forgot all... S- Subjects are, uh, h- how do we say this, Mr. Ripper? I don't know. All, all subjects uh, may have explicit and adult language oh, and, oh, and yeah, content, yeah, yeah. so yeah, yeah. make sure that you uh, don't play this shit around your motherfucking kid. Okay, let me stop. All right. That's enough of that. Um, you didn't even notice the, um, the, the change in, in uh, yeah, 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 2019. I, yeah. <laughs> yeah I, I, boy, you, come on, man. It's me. Okay. Yes. I was going to say, who is that lovely voice? <laughs> yeah, gosh, she, she sounds so sensual. Uh, just, she sounds sensual. Huh? It just strikes her, strikes her. Just does something to you. Yeah, just <laughs> I, I don't know. It just does something to me. Oh, we gonna man. we gonna leave that right there. Speaking of doing something, mm-hmm. you know, you know, it's it's past the season. It's a new year, new start. You know, yeah, yeah. You know, we, and we got past Christmas and all that, and now, now we're into the mm-hmm. to the nineteen. Yep. But yep, I, I yep. do want to step back and talk about your man Kanye again. Why would you, I mean, excuse me, Mm -hmm. I'm saying why, but needless to say, he bought Kim Kardashian a condo for $14 million. That was Mm -hmm. one of the Christmas gifts that he gave her. Mm -hmm. Now, mind you, Mm -hmm. I mean, you you got the money like that. Hey, you can't take it with you. You got to got to get off of it for tax purposes and all that good stuff. But $14 million for a condo in Miami. Mm-hmm. Okay, so I, I don't I don't know if that, jeez, that's just a lot of damn money for a condo. It's a mega unit. That's Miami, probably in the it, spot it's at. That, that's what I was gonna say. Now it was uh, Miami condo, mm-hmm. uh, billion dollar beach bungalow is you know, dub. That's what they're dubbing it or calling it. Mm-hmm. Four thousand seven hundred square feet. That's kind of small for fourteen million. Uh, five and a half bathrooms. You want more? <laughs> yeah, five and a half bathrooms, nigga. I'm already almost there, and I ain't got that many uh, mm. that many square feet. It's 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 you know featured you know huge terrace, you know, but it's I don't know. I guess it has all the amenities that it it needs to have, but. Fourteen million. I can see a couple of mil. So, what's your question? You say why? Why? I mean, you know, it, it sounds like a fuck spot for for the next nigga to, uh, you know, fuck on, on on Miami Beach when. Nah, actually, she 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 actually has a side hustle, has real estate and rentals and stuff. Okay, so so uh, all righty. Well, I hope th- that's not a good deal if she got the hook up on the on the uh, estate, then because that that shouldn't uh, she should have got that at a better deal there. I'm just saying, fourteen mil is a lot on a condo. Hey, it gotta be. I mean, gotta be near that. If you gotta be with, with location, that, I that mean, them need to be right in the ocean. That a floating barge, they can they can take that bitch from New York to goddamn uh, over, over. I don't know, fourteen mil. All right, but I guess hey, to each his own. Yeah, you know, yeah. I, I can think of a lot more things that I could do for fourteen. <laughs> Once again, for the new year. 2018 is out. Who's killing it on the ground? I know I'm not, you know, but Media Cartel is pretty up there. But, of course, we're not in the top ten yet. That is the operative word, yet. But, you know, as 18 has passed, 19 has come in, there are celebrities that they that has boosted their number for the year of 18, and they're projecting for the numbers to keep going up. Selena, what's her name? Uh, Selena Gomez. Gomez, Gomez was Gomez. number one last year. She is no longer in the number one spot. Justin Timberlake is doing it at number 10 with uh, about 103 million followers. Uh, and I think these are renewed numbers, not uh, total numbers, you know, of 
What you mean renew? Like, you know, more fans that they've gotten in, in uh, 18. Uh, I can't say this word. This, this, nah, that's got to be total. That's total? Yeah, okay, because, you know, I'm, I'm not an ig -er. So, uh, what is this? Uh, Nymore Jr., N-E-Y. Nah, I don't uh, know who that is. Uh, I, I don't know who the hell he is, but he has 108 million followers. I think that's one of them dudes do like the show off the expensive shit thing. I don't know. I don't. I don't really be okay, into that yeah, scene. Yeah, he, he looks like a, a pretty boy. I can see maybe the females trying to follow him. I think it's one of the dudes just they just show off a lot of expensive shit. Like right, right. Yeah, yeah. I, I don't know. You know, like they got a little kid that's hot for doing that, and they got a black dude. He just know a lot of people. I mean, they right. Yeah, I don't know. I don't really be into him. Uh, Taylor Swift, she's at number eight, mm -hmm. one hundred and fourteen million. Taylor uh, kind of getting chunky, it seems like. Hell no. Okay, just the picture that I'm that they're showing right now. Nah, let me see that shit. I, I, that, like, that's oh, the, oh. she's the queen of flat ass. Yeah, I, I, yeah. Taylor look look like she got a little. Nah, that's that, that's that's the, just the yeah, angle. Yeah, 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 somebody did something to that. Yeah, that, that, that little that, damn that, way. Yeah, cause that's what that's why I was like, whoa, hold on, I ain't never. Yeah. Paid attention to yeah, it. Yeah, that's some damn. He looking at some pictures. It's, it's, <laughs> it's from a show in Sydney, so whatever. That's what you looking at. Yeah. So. Nah, that's some that's some bullshit. That, that's just a good angle. That's just. Yeah. A, that's uh, matter of fact, now we talking about what the fuck's going on with Madonna? Did she get? Did somebody blow up her ass? Oh my god. Did you see that? No, I didn't. But uh, um, Madonna always getting. Uh, I know. Look, I don't know. We, everybody, nobody knows. They're trying to figure it out right now. She was a video of her. She was singing. You know, because a lot of everybody sing the sing on New Year's Eve. You know, to get paid right, big exactly. money. And she was singing at um, uh, shit. I don't. I don't even know where she was, but I think she was out of out of out of out of uh, country. Um, and her ass was like swole, like <laughs> Beyonce swole. <laughs> like, like somebody had hit it from. Everybody the back was like, "What the fuck?" It. Everybody trying to figure it back before she hit on. Got nah, like she went and got some ass, um, ass surgery. Ass surgery. Hey, it wouldn't surprise me, Madonna. So stay tuned next week. We'll yeah, know by then. We'll, we'll know such a. They all, they, they, they all trying to figure it out. Yeah. Well, uh, uh, Beyonce's uh, one hundred and twenty-one. She's at number seven. Uh, Kelly Jenner is one hundred and twenty-two million at number six. Mm -hmm. At number six, tying is <coughs> Kim K at one hundred and twenty-two again. Uh, do you think Kim K is fine? Yeah. Okay. I, but it's but it's but it's build a body. It is. Okay. Uh, I, I yeah. She, she she the picture is pretty decent. The Rock has a hundred and twenty five. She's at number four. Uh, I can't say her name again. The little Spanish chick, Andrea Grande. Oh yeah. Uh, uh, uh -huh. hundred and thirty nine. She's at number three. Uh, Sling Gomez, a hundred and forty four. I thought you already said her. Nope, she's at number two. I say she got knocked out of number one spot. Oh, oh bet, bet. So she's you. at the number bet, two that's spot. What you saying. And number one is, I can't even, another Spanish name, Cristal, Cristino, uh, the soccer Ronaldo. Player. Yeah, the soccer player. Oh, is that what it, yeah, okay. And he's at 149 million followers. Gee, and, she and must the, play some good ball. I actually does. He's the best. He is the best. He's the highest paid and the best soccer player. Okay, that's so. Sure. But at the same time, women have said he's the best looking man on earth. So on earth, I mean that's who they scribe the best looking man. They, they must ain't saw our pictures, bro. <laughs> um, <laughs> um, he um, I also that that is crazy because soccer is big. So are those really soccer fans or are they really women? Just horny women. Right, exactly. I mean, I've never been on this, so I don't know if he's got a lot of pictures with his shirt off. I'm going to say it's not soccer fans. It's not a <laughs> bunch of men. It's... Yeah, it's, it's, it's probably a combination of, well, he, he was fully dressed with his wife and kid, so on the picture that I saw. But mm. quite sure women women adore, the, adore him and the soccer fans uh, mm. appreciate his skills. Uh, so it's probably it, a combination. Yeah, kind of like, I mean, I don't know. I've never been on this. On the ground, so I don't know what the fuck he does, but it's kind of like it, not you brought up, maybe think about Iggy is that you crazy right. ass, right? It's kind of like buying her boyfriend a uh, a what 
Yeah. Uh, oh, I, I thought you was talking. Yeah. Continue. No, she bought. For- no, no, no. It's it's kind of like how she um got mad about when she uh, a couple last year in the last year she got mad about uh the 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 the, the porn site uh was one of the one of the porn sites asked the one of her to uh do some pictures. No, do a porn. Uh-huh. Like, we'll, we'll hire you to do a porn. And then a lot of her fans were on her page like, hell yeah, hell yeah. Like, do it, do it. And then she got, tried to go off like, oh, oh how dare you try to do me, to, uh, tell me to do porn and blah, blah, blah. I'm a, I'm a music artist and blah, blah, blah. I wouldn't, whatever, to try to make like porn stars were low, low, you know. Oh, okay. But the crazy part is, but if you go on her page, and that, that's what ha- they, they, they half had. her stuff is yeah it's, it's damn near porn it's, right. it's like you're half naked right exactly I mean that's why they're on that's what that's what those people you, those people who follow your gram that's what they're there for they're, yeah exactly <laughs> it's not like you got a bunch of music up there if you it, well I mean half ne- uh, naked in some pictures you is naked so yeah so I, I what I did you expect them to want exactly I don't know what they she expected because that's pretty much what Half the pictures is so. I mean, yeah, it's like Coke. One, it's like Coke getting mad because people asked them for a soda, <laughs> right? <laughs> a- ask for it by name, Coca Cola, not soda. Yeah, right. Okay. You have any tattoos, bro? Yeah. Okay. Would you put a tattoo of your girlfriend on your body? Come on now. Ain't okay. No I'm sense. just asking, man. I mean, I'm, you know, uh, I know the answer. They uh, don't. Yeah, I, it's, 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 it's quite a few females who got my own tattoo on my name tattooed on them. Okay. But nah, nah. Okay. Because uh, I, I was just complex mm-hmm. with uh, Nikki putting tattoo on her uh, 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 boyfriend. The, uh, the new dude? Yeah. The, yeah. I don't know. The new boyfriend has no her name. On him. Oh, I thought you said she got it no, on no, him. No, 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 no. Like you, like you say, yeah, females may have your name on. Might as well, he needs something to keep this shit going. Oh, is yeah. that what it is? Okay. Uh, it's not hurting his credit. Yeah, it's hurting his skin. I'm just saying. I mean, I mean, he, not the game he playing. Oh, okay. So, not not the game he playing. I get. I guess I'm still. I mean, you you got to think about it. it he 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 he's straight. He done leveled up, like Sierra say. Okay. I mean, level up, level up. I mean, level and then he say fuck <laughs> off and leave him, leave him alone tomorrow. I mean, he now has been introduced to a higher level of females. Oh, okay. So, or however you want to look at it. I mean, so whatever she, he prefers. So she done brung him up to at least uh, safari stage now. Yeah, he's on a higher level. I mean, now it's like. What he was dealing with before, he didn't have to deal with it now. He's, 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 he's in a whole new... He, she's opened the door for him to a whole new group. A whole new tax bracket, huh? Yeah. Okay. All right. Well, uh, moving on in stories. That, that's good for them. I'm happy for them. Um, it's kind of like we, we 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 started... Either one of us started dating Holly Berry. It's like, now we on a whole nother... And then she brought it with us. Yeah, that's cool, but now we on a whole nother level. Oh, okay. We ain't got to do that other than regular... That regular, nah. Okay. <laughs> we can walk in doors that that we could get it in. Used to be closed. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Mm-hmm. Um, Rihanna dropped a new album. Uh, so did Twenty One Savage. Twenty One, Twenty One. But uh, uh, she on her album, mm-hmm. she get it gave a dedication to one of her super fans. Mm-hmm. Uh, on the song uh, "Love You, My Angel." Mm-hmm. Uh, it's about one of her super fans that uh, is Pat that died of cancer. Now, my question to you, because mm-hmm. I'm not quite clear, what is? I mean, I know by definition a super fan, but this seems like a new thing. What's a super fan? How do you become a super fan? Is there an application that you put in? How, how does this super fan thing work? <laughs> it's not a new thing. I mean, it's a lot. It's a lot of people. Actually, a lot of super fans that they have died this this holiday season. Couple died saying. on Christmas Eve. Right. Uh, well, well, it's usually that. That's the, how do you come to super? They usually, <laughs> well, not all of them, but um, the ones that have just recently died, they mostly were sick, mm-hmm. and that was their favorite thing. And you know, either through people on them or Make a Wish Foundation, you know, oh, okay. made them made it known, and they just did their everything to support that that artist, artist. or or okay. team like. Like I think, well, you said the one from Rihanna died. I think the other three that died, they were sports team. Oh, okay. They were sports team super fans, right? And you know they got, to, you know they got to go to the game. 
they got to, they got to go to the game and, and um they got you know they got to support the team over the years through their health battles and the team supported them came to the hospital and stuff like that. Cool. And then, okay. You know, yeah. All right. Well, yeah, that that makes you. I I didn't know if it was you know because like you say when you say super fan is like well damn mm-hmm. how do you separate them from the rest of your adoring fans? But mm-hmm. I, I I I get it now. Okay. Well, that was very nice of her to do also and like you say to uh, support. Mm-hmm. You know any of the fans and, and to go over and beyond to do that that's that's very gracious uh miss wendy williams claims her husband's alleged mistress is not pregnant <laughs> hmm. been married you know of course they her and her husband been married uh, i think about 21 years now 21 <laughs> 21 uh the cheating allegations are surrounding you know surrounding the situation about him having an affair and that his longtime uh, mistress mm-hmm. uh-huh. uh, is pregnant now. You know, uh, uh, Wendy. Uh, hmm. Talking about fucking up the money. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Uh, so I, hey, I, you know, I guess moral to that story is if you go, like, I guess he is he on he was already kind of. Stable before Whitney, wasn't he? I mean, Whitney. Whitney. Uh, Wendy. <laughs> I don't know, bro. He was, I think he was kind of in the, the, the industry, but not necessarily. I have no idea that answer. Uh, okay. Well, uh, bo- bottom line is, you know, you got that. Just, uh, yeah. Ain't no bottom line to it. Don't, you, don't, don't be fucking up shit. You fucking up the money, like you said. Yeah, sound like good for her, bad for him. Yeah, it, that's where I'm going. You know, so. Uh-oh. Uh, what else is going on in the world? Uh, well, um, your girl, uh, we talked about it last year, but remember Tiffany Haddish, whatever, how you say that? Right. Thing. Mm-hmm. Um, I like her, nothing against her, not a hater against her, but remember I talked about, I said I'd rather see her in a movie, not the comedy, because they were trying to beef up the... Right. I didn't really, I didn't, I'm not really didn't care for her. For comedy, it was the same thing. She just kept going. Well, she did a show in Miami. I, yeah, it was in Miami, I think. Mm-hmm. And she bombed. Boom. Yep. Yeah. For New Year's, New yeah. Year's night. And people, yeah, they said half the crowd walked out. It was that bad. Yeah, I heard that. And she just said, fuck it, and got mad and started drinking. Some more? A bottle, no, a bottle of Chirac. <laughs> uh, yeah. Uh, like I said, she she goes into that. that, that, that she, she, try, she plays off the hood thing too much. She just... It's like it's, I remember, I told you it's gonna get old. Didn't I say that? Mm-hmm. Yeah, you did. You 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 professed it, mm-hmm. and and I and I agree with you. I, I'd rather see her in uh in in shows than mm-hmm. just uh she's the comedy is okay. Mm-hmm. And uh, I, I I agree. I just agree. With you. I said the comedy was, was garbage. I want to see her in the movie, and, and it's funny. Uh, scripted movie and it's funny. Uh, then I said, it's, and I said reverse about Kevin Hart. I would have seen him in stand up. Then I would have seen him in a movie right. now. Mm-hmm. It's just getting it's too much now. Yeah. But uh, damn. I got night school. Haven't watched it. You said you watched it. It's good. It's okay. Would I like it? Probably not, because I said it's okay. <laughs> okay. So if it's okay, you are gonna be like, what? This stupid shit. It, it's yeah. uh, well. Here we go. Let me let me rewind uh-huh. that. Uh-huh. I say it's okay because it's just okay. It's it, it's not a bad movie. Mm-hmm. Um, of course, they have their little funny scenes, okay. but it's it's a movie. I'm, I'm gonna do just like they said on, on when they were promoting it. Mm-hmm. It's a movie about second chances, about having second chances at life and do overs in life. So it has a good moral story to it. But it's a comedy, so is it gonna make me? Is so, I'm gonna, uh, so therefore, does the storyline makes sense. And, uh, and the storyline makes sense, but it doesn't make sense for a com- comedy show, mm-hmm. uh, for comedy uh, thing. Mm-hmm. So that's why it's okay. They have their funny scenes, mm-hmm. but they're still trying to be serious. And so if you're looking at it for a nice uh, sit down and set up, so I can fuck. Right, exactly. <laughs> you, that's, yeah. that's a good movie. Okay. If you're looking at it for laughter, yeah. Not gonna get too many laughter. Uh, if you're looking at it for the plot and 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 the moral of the story, yeah, it's okay. Uh-huh. So that's why it's just okay. I think I went in there looking more for the laughter. Yeah, you said okay for a minute. So 
It's it's okay. It's definitely not a bad movie. But anyway, uh, I, 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 yeah. Well, you already mentioned that she flopped on 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 the first. Uh, what's the deal, man? Mm -hmm. Uh, have you seen Steve Harvey's uh stepdaughter? No, 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 no. I just seen Steve Harvey, but no. I, I heard she she she's a nice, nice looking, nice look to the eyes. Mm -hmm. But uh, I also heard. Nah, she, we'll Google that. Yeah, we'll we'll have to Google that one. But uh, also, uh, mm -hmm. you know, I, I guess she she's in the industry. But uh, Mr. Trey Song supposedly is tapping nah. that ass right now. He knocking it down. Knocking it down, and uh, you know, they like, whoa, how y'all together? And why not, man, Mr. Uh, what's in take in in his thing, Mr. Take Your Girl or something? Isn't that his little feature or whatever? Anyway, my whole point is, he, he can, he can get him a boo. He, you know, he ain't got to be a hoe for the rest of his life. Man, I, know. I thought he did have a, a lady before. I couldn't even tell you. I really, but I mean, I don't mean that's his lady. They could just be. Yeah, they, they, and that's and you're y'all right. making shit more than what it is. So. Exactly, and, and that's and that's where exactly where I was going. He's been booed up with her for the, uh, you know, for a couple of pictures, and now they they're deeming them as a couple. Mm. He can just be, y'all just called him on Good Smash Nights. Or yeah, she must look good. He around here taking pictures with her, so. Right, exactly. You know, uh, hanging out with her for the for the seasons going into the new year. Oh, that's good. cuddle season. <laughs> right, right. Yeah, I'm yeah, off right. right now, so I don't really know about this shit. <laughs> <laughs> we going to keep I it moving. Uh, speaking of Mr. Hennig, say I am off. Can't wait till February 15th. Season is closed. Said February 15th is the next rip holiday. <laughs> yeah, rip day. The the. Day after you done fucked up and didn't get your girl Ooh, a good Valentine. Uh, yeah. Smash I mean, all night. Yeah. yeah take re yeah, take yeah, revenge. Yeah. Call Smash me, baby. Me. Take revenge. I will be your dildo. <laughs> say, I will be your personal. Mm. Mm. Uh, speaking of Mr. Kevin Hart, mm. his uh, tour is over and it did a uh, spectacular box. What do you call it? Numbers. Numbers. Uh, would you still call those uh, box what yeah. Do you call it? Uh, okay. Uh, did number good numbers, uh, but at the end of his uh, tour, he gave all his homies, all his crew. Oh yeah, yeah. The comedians, uh, old schools. Yeah, I saw that. Which was that? That was. To oh, me, but I didn't know that's what that was. I thought that was. Uh, I thought that was his homeboys. I didn't know that was the people that worked with him. Yeah, that was like the you know the I mean, that, comedians that that were, that opened up for him. Right, that I didn't know. Yeah, uh, uh, yeah, I I thought that was just his homeboys. He bought that for 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 the holidays. Yeah, nah, that that's the homeboys. Like the they call themselves the plastic cup boys, uh, which is a, a, a uh, it's like a you know that's their little clique. But it's a it's like six six of them and all of them are comedians. Or oh, I I know what you heard of whatever. Yeah, but uh, yeah, they pick in a way. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. They they put in work. Yeah, it's kind of like the record company. They buy you a car, right? Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, you know, hey, it was a nice gesture. You know, hey, you gotta watch Cadillac Records. <laughs> <laughs> that shit put some real game in some shit. Segway. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So, yeah. What that old dude told me he said, "Nah, bro, keep the car. I'll just give me my money. Yeah, get, just give me my goddamn money. You keep the damn car. <laughs> okay. Uh." Uh, I briefly mentioned 21 Savage new album uh, dropped a rap before the new year. Uh, I am, I was. I am. I am, I was. No, just I am. Just I am. Yeah. Oh, okay. Uh, my, my thing is uh, reading wrong, but it, it debuted coming into the new year at the top of the Billboard 100. So that's a good look for Mr. Savage himself. Uh, uh, Kodak Black hit number one on 200 last week. That's, see, bam, see, oh, boy, look at that, look at that song, doing the damn thing. Speaking of doing the damn thing, why the fuck is Lil Wayne mm -hmm. going on stage in some Uggs? <laughs> that is not. <laughs> what? Yeah. Lil Wayne was uh, wearing Uggs. In they make them Uggs. for men? Okay, so Lil Wayne was wearing Uggs uh, on his first sighted performance uh uh for for going into the new year uh why what 36 year old man come on man i i i, I ain't gonna I, say I it how, I, I have experienced some weird shit uh, around him but 
<laughs> nah, I know you gonna say it, but I said that off, off mic. Right? But, uh, yeah. Yeah. I mean, it, it, they may, and I've heard they're very comfortable. But I've heard that. I don't. I don't know about they comfortable or not. I mean, I don't even know they make them for men. Well, I mean, I. Well, they. I never. They, I, 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 you to say. Matter of fact, I know. Matter of fact, I know you've seen a man. Well, well, not even a gay man. Oh God! Not that I be that checking, is... but I'm just saying. I, well, not, get... I don't even know they make them for me. So well, I mean, a shoe. Maybe is a shoe. maybe it's a new season. Maybe he got the first pair. Well, well <laughs> right, exactly. You know, he, he he's a shoe is a shoe. I don't, you know. Nah, a shoe I, ain't no fucking shoe. Uh, excuse me, a boot is a boot. A boot ain't definitely not a boot. Yeah, I mean, it, it doesn't have heels. Are you crazy? Did you see that boot that hold that hold that was in the store that bust her neck trying to own them damn boots? On the boot. But that, I'm, I'm that's that. not a, that's you can't say all boots. Then they got then you got uh then you got lugs or uh, uh, uh Timberlands. Those are okay. men boots. And you know what? Right. <laughs> so no, you can't say a boot is a boot. As as the lovely Mrs. Those always, clearly are two different boots. Yeah, as the lovely Mrs. <laughs> says to me all the time, I've I've misspoken my words yeah. and my I should have said mm-hmm. the UGG boots don't have heels so that boot just look it could ah, be they've been doing some different things with them they, I have, they can be i have they do have uggs with heels oh they do yeah they i seen the other a week or last week they got uh actually look kind of rough it was okay. I, I, this was definitely female right uh it was a high high uh, uh it came all the way up to the leg, whatever they call them high right high, to the knee yeah yeah knee high boots knee high, uh, yeah. boot, and it had a heel on it oh okay that's what's up well he didn't have those on he just had the regular. I'm pretty sure he didn't have those. He on. just had the regular <laughs> Uggs that look. To I, me, I, they look like. Not only will you heard about it, I would have definitely. <laughs> <laughs> the whole point is. It would have been a whole different type of conversation. Right. The whole point is, you know, hey, he's he's starting a new fashion trend. So I, I don't know if that. Nah, 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 nah. I don't nah, know nah, that should have catch on like skinny nah, jeans. Nah, 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 nah. Nah, nah, ain't gonna. It ain't okay. All right. Ah. <sighs> Uh, Usher filed for divorce after three years of marriage. Nah, for real. I missed that one. Yeah, you know. Uh, again. Again, yeah. I, he, he just he just need to keep tapping him and, uh, you know, just, I, I don't think that's working for him. Yeah, let that fat hoe fuck this shit up. I hope not. Or, or he, okay, let me leave that one on too. All right. Um, I don't know, but he liked them old looking women though, so. Now, I got a question for you. Since you're a, a movie mm-hmm. and, and TV enthusiast. Yeah. Everybody talking about uh, Bird Day, Bird Bath, Bird bird in a Cage, Birds. birds bird Box, high. man. Uh, oh, yeah, Birds. Bird, I thought it was Birds Flying High. Blue Bird. The blue, okay, I'm sorry. I'm being funny, folks. Uh, have you seen the movie? Yeah, yeah, of course. Is it a good movie? Damn good movie. Why is it so? Because I keep hearing, you know, it's like the ish. And when I saw the trailer, it kind of was in sleepiness. It kind of made me want to fall asleep on the trailer. So, uh, um, nah, it's just good. It's a different. It's, it's a it's a different type. I mean, for horror movies are pretty pretty hot right now. But the thing is, everybody keep rehashing the same thing in horror movies right like far as like the jump scares same jump scares and same shit so when you got movies like get out and bird box they come it's like they it's horrible they bring a new thing new twist to it. yeah so like yeah people like it it's different okay you know so so it's a horror kind of horror yeah but it ain't like it's not like it's not not your typical it's like get out okay. it's about as scary as get out is it's not scary speaking of getting out and 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 um, it, it just gives a different twist. Twist. Only thing I, my only thing my complaint was it. I don't know if anybody else picked up on it, but now if they had you know black people like as main character roles. Uh huh. But in the in the this, if you look at I look at everything in the movie, but if you look at the the background scenes and what's going on, mm-hmm. like all the people that were dying or, or, or running, they were all white. What? They weren't like black. They wasn't Mexican, Japanese, Asian, or whatever. They just was most, most of the extras was all white. I don't know if anybody else picked up on that. Just that just seemed kind of weird. You're looking at it from a side point of view. Everybody mm-hmm. in there was not white. Not the whole movie. I said not the. I said the the extras. Not the all background. Not all extras were white. They had some. 
colored things in there. I didn't see many. Okay, I didn't see the movie, so I'm I'm just being you know stereotypical. Mm. Uh, but speaking of uh, of getting out, mm. speaking of little Rail, because Rail, Rail was in that movie, right? Yeah, little Rail. Was in a, okay, um, little Rail. Yeah, that was that what he called? Yeah, Rail. I know. I didn't know it was well, little Rail. I thought it, he used to be little Rail. He's Rail now. Oh, I didn't know it. Yeah, I think he used to be little Rail. Oh, but okay. when he got the TV show, I mean, pretty much. Oh, pretty when he got fat. Or something. Well, you know, it was the pun because he's oh, always been judged. I didn't know. I didn't know. I didn't know. Anyway, but uh, mm-hmm. and I could be wrong. I don't know. But uh, the other day, you you sent me a trailer for a. Oh yeah. Uh, fire ass. I don't remember the name of it. Uh, us. Us. Man. <laughs> Bless you. That 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 looks like it's gonna be. Now it now is he uh. Is that uh, one that Rail's producing? I mean, uh, nah, nah, he's not even. He's no one. I mean, not, That's not the, Rail. Uh, I mean, the, uh, uh, the uh, other guy. Yeah, the dude did get out. Uh, yeah. Jordan Peele. Yeah, Peele. That's what mm. I was. Yeah, I was that's thinking. his thing. I'm sorry. I was just still on Rail. Yeah, that shit looked like it was fire. Yeah, yeah, that shit gonna be fire. Yeah, yeah. If you haven't checked it out, go go to uh, rather you go to YouTube, and pull up the trailer for it's called Us. Mm-hmm. And uh. I'm pretty sure everybody has seen that though. Yeah, yeah, that that's I boy, you blew me away with that one. That was nice. Do you have do you know when that one even comes out? Uh expect that I think it said February. February yeah, yeah, the f- top of this year. Mm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. Uh suspect arrested uh for the eight hundred K in Usher's uh you know, when he got burglarized, the burglary case. Oh yeah, uh, yeah. He had a bunch of not just Usher, a lot of people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, the, the suspect, it's not the same suspect, though, for... Yeah, it is. It is? Mm-hmm. He got, oh, okay, well, wow, he was busy. And they, yeah, 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 they found the, they found a lot of this stuff. They had the, they got picked up for the stars to go through and look and see what's... What's theirs? Yeah, yeah. hmm Yeah, wow. they found it. He had, like, a couple of storage units. Wow. He's, you know he's supposed to fence that off quickly. I'm, I'm, nah, I'm, not quickly. I mean, that's how you get caught quickly. So you probably, I mean, it's high, if it's supposed to be high end jury, right? That's why I say he probably trying to fit it off too quickly. Well, quickly. Oh, I don't know. They didn't say how he got caught. Oh, mm. he's supposed to. He's supposed to sit on that and, and, and probably running his damn mouth. Anyway, I, yeah, yeah. The old lady didn't get the right Christmas present. Right. He, oh yeah, he got he got the stash over there. And <laughs> you know how the shit go. Either that or she she wanted the big. Big diamond necklace. Are you any hoes? Girl, you can't wear that because so and so had that and they saw that at the Emmys and mm. you get caught with it, we gonna get caught. All right, yeah. well, fuck <laughs> it. Ain't nobody gonna have that yet. Okay. Mm-hmm. Um, <clears throat> oh, what I, oh, crazy shit. Uh, what is, I, you, I, you might be a little familiar with it. Uh, Bonnie Pointer, you know what I'm talking about? Nah. From the Pointer Sisters? Oh, okay. I know who you, I know the Pointer Sisters. I don't know. Specifically, well, she was seen at a New Year's Eve party. This is sounded bad already. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's a lot of crazy shit happening New Year's Eve from Madonna's big ass to, to her. She was singing, and you know, she's one of them old school singers, and they sing like they open their mouth like super wide to sing, right? Exactly. Well, something flew in her mouth. Oh, damn, and she does have some scoop coolers, okay? Yeah, and then she had she had to turn around and throw up. Oh, damn, why yeah, she, why uh, she performed? Yeah, uh huh. Yeah, not a good look. Yeah. Well, more to the story is a uh, singing harmony, not with your mouth and your tongue right over. Okay, all right, let me leave that one alone. <laughs> what? <laughs> I, I, nothing, nothing at all, sir. Don't make me repeat myself. We're gonna leave that one alone. Uh, did you see the 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 the, the fight about the straw? No, I didn't. Yeah, I just you know, I just yeah, I, I, I the remember you telling me about the. But you ain't know about it. Uh. Uh-uh. Well, it happened in Florida, of course. Hey. Uh, down south. So, white dude comes in McDonald's, Uh-oh. and I think this was a parka. <laughs> you know, you know, you get the goals from them back right, in the day. Right, right, right. Get them grilled. Then, I mean, they closed down. The, the, not closed down. The office moved now, but. Uh, right. Um, that was the capital. Yeah. So, uh, dude comes in there. Order some food, then he goes to the thing, and he had no straw for his for his meal. So he comes back and he, he, he starts yelling at the lady behind, the, you know, at uh-huh. the counter, right? And like, oh, he wants straws. And the lady was like, well, we don't, we can't 
it's by law we we can't um put draws out which was it just started in new year's first for apaca they get it's against the law for them to put draws out in the lobby and, uh-huh and they can only uh, but it guests can request them and then they can give it to them Do but you? but then by for this year only and then in 2020 uh there won't be no more straws at all in apaca why is that do you know Oh, uh, that's the law they passed in the pocket. No wow, single, okay. single yeah. use straws. Right. Okay. In, in, in the in the restaurant. Yeah, I thought that was that weird. I pocket. heard about it, but yeah, yeah that is crazy. But then so it. anyway, dude was mad about the straw. Got up the whatever with him and the girl. I guess if she must have gave him a straw because I did see the straw on his tray. Right. But whatever, you know, it had no audio. So whatever, they was arguing. He reached across the counter, grabbed the mm. grabbed the shirt. Damn. Well, that was his mistake. Uh-oh. Cause when he did that, she grabbed his shirt, and then she the yanked. On oh it. yeah, she went the whack. She came put him on. Wham, wham, lady. and beat the shit out of the dude, the yeah, white dude. Yeah, you gonna you gonna know he asked he asked for more than a straw that time. Yeah, yeah. And he he ended up going to getting locked up, but not for that. What did he get locked up for then? Oh well, like according <laughs> to them, the white guy was homeless. Mm-hmm. So after after all that, you know, his meal went flying in the air, and of course, you know, they didn't give him another meal. Right. So he I, apparently, I guess he left. Nobody called police, or if they did, I don't know. But he didn't go. He ended up. I guess he got hungry later. In, oh man. Yeah, he robbed somebody. Damn. 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 <laughs> that's what he ended. That's, he tried to rob somebody or whatever. Wow. So that's, I guess. Yeah, all over a straw. Yeah. Mm 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 mm. More to the story is. Suck it up. Mm. Get it how you can. Okay. I don't know if that was a good moral. Oh, damn. Just suck it up. You don't always have to have a straw. Sometimes you have to drink your pride with a big cold thing of iced tea. Yeah, I don't know what the fuck's going on with these zoos in Florida, so. What's the deal? I I ain't heard nothing about the zoo. Oh, you know, the little girl got, I mean, a little girl fell through the damn hippo thing. No, I ain't hear about that. She didn't that get one. killed. Yeah, down south, little zoo thing. She fell through the little, she went through the whales. Oh goodness! That's a hippo, rhino. Rhino, okay. Yeah, and then uh, 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 another white girl. She got killed by an African uh, lion. Yeah, so now that one I did, but but I thought that was like on a uh, on like a uh, not a, what conservation it? zoo. Yeah. Zoo, same thing. Okay. Different, a different type of zoo. Right. Well, that's bitches. That just man. different funding and different grants. Yeah, they, they they shouldn't have that shit in the open like that. Like a safari was like a safari uh, ride thing. No, 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 no. That's not what happened. Oh, I thought it was like a safari. You know how? They no, 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 no. They don't have that here. Okay. That's I, that's most likely in them tourist countries and stuff. Well, no, I mean, um, yeah, I know, but like you know how Bush Garden has like. Their thing, and it's not a safari safari. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Ride. Yeah, we got like the little fake ones. Right. They don't have like a when you talk about where you got like actual lions, like we, right. And that's yeah, what yeah. I thought. That's she like was on. yeah, that's a whole nother country. Right, but we had like, we've the got fake a little ones. fake ones where it would be a giraffe, or safe animals. Right. Something. Yeah, yeah. So that's be. what. But I thought it was kind of like the fake one we we have. Mm-hmm. But I thought a lion. Not with that. Not with an African lion. No, 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 no. Yeah, they, yeah, they They're not gonna allow that. Yeah. Well, shit. Apparently. No, no. She worked there. Oh, she worked there. Yeah, and they were doing a regular. She had just started working. She hadn't been there long. She's at. She's. I think she graduated from college, and now she's in training. You right. know, I guess it's a lot of steps to be a veterinarian and right, a zoo exactly. veterinarian, mm-hmm. a zoologist, maybe zoologist, that. Right. So, she was at her. This, this is this is probably her second or third internship at at one of those places, and this was a new place for her. Right. I think she's been there like a month and a half, and so she was. They were doing a routine clean, and damn lion got loose. Mm, but it, and the crazy shit about it is that the, 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 it goes to show you how white people lie about shit like these crazy white animals. Right. It's like they care about they, they care about that. She, even though the thing she was like, oh, a woman died, then the lion died. I'm like, fuck the lion, the person died. Yeah, exactly. But not even that. You can tell they care more about the them lion. than they do about any black people. So it's like you already know what it is because it just came out it's happened about like New Year's Eve but it just came out last night mm-hmm. that the neighbors around the place said nah they, they let the cow to bed and, they, and, they, and, they, and the new people were able to find like 911 calls that damn lion that happens all the time like lions get loose in the neighborhood not just loose in the in, in the preserve yeah it's yeah. got the lion has the lions have gotten loose a couple of times in wow. the whole area wow 
and it was like imagine pulling but, up at night but they still the but the people still trying to cover, cover it up because up. they because they give that that shows you right there they care more about that fucking line than they do a human life right do you imagine coming from the club getting the equipment out the car <laughs> To my lion just sitting at your at, at your damn porch. Yeah, I was, nah, nah. I heard I had pulled up some shit like pull up to a chick house like and I heard some shit like raw like oh that's a motherfucking panther like <laughs> yeah, how like, oh hell no nah. damn black panther fuck that <laughs> yeah I had to get my shit damn right <laughs> bitch come outside. Hey. Yeah, yeah. So I do know what you're talking about. It is, it is a fucked up. I mm-hmm. have pulled up yeah. to a chick, couple chick house like that happened. Them chicks in the in the in the boonies. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I had to go yeah, after the club, so you know, late night. Yeah, it wasn't nobody out jumped out. I had ain't no damn lights there. In the- yeah, yeah. I had to do a little ride to get the little chick house. And, mm-hmm. and I didn't see it now, right? which most times you don't see you a don't Florida see them, yeah. Florida man. And I heard that man. I was like, what the fuck? Oh, you were smelling right? But uh. Yeah, man. Yeah, I, I didn't smell it. I heard it, and I was like, "What the fuck?" Hell to the no! Mm-hmm. Anyway, hit us up. You know how to find us. It's a new year, new times, same podcast, better information. Media part, excuse me, media cartel podcast. You can reach us at media cartel mix show gmail dot com. Hit us up. Give us all the information that you need. Any comments, suggestions, all that good stuff. IG, Media Podcast, uh, Facebook, YouTube, all that stuff. Subscribe, download on Fanburst. You know how to find us, and it's a new year, so make sure you tell a friend to tell a friend to tell another friend to tell a goddamn friend so we can get all this shit in. Until next time, yours truly, Ozzy Oz, your main man, Mr. Ripper. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We are.